a big animal moving all the time. So when he lies down, it's a major undertaking. Right, like this. Mm -hmm. And I just rub inside here. And then with my fingertips. So you can use all this kind of edge of the ulnar border here, the little border. So you can work all around the abdomen. Get all into the inner aspect of the, the thigh. With Red's breed and similar dogs to Red that are very, very strong, you really want to get hands-on with these guys. You really want to make sure that they're well handled, well rubbed, and be thorough and really vigorous in your massage. You really want to get all the sides to be able to really work right through there. And you get that nice hollow sound because you want to cup your hand so it isn't flat like this. It traps a lot of air and then you can get all the way around. And especially with animals with really big chests, you can work all the sides at the same time and then you can do this kind of thing. Oh boy, Red, you're easy to rub. Yes, you are. There you go. Very nice, yeah. So if you can rub red the right way, you can rub just about any dog the right way. For more information on massaging your pet the right way, visit PetYourPet.ca or thepetnetwork.tv.